Since it's your birthday, here's your damn birthday present. Don't talk to this device, too. Ah, shit. Wait, what is this? A MacBook? Dude, this is the best gift I ever got ever since that Game Boy Color with the broken A button. Why won't my MacBook power on? I say with so much emphasis on the A. I haven't even been here that long and this seems familiar. Like a callback to act one of a play or something. I know, right? Oh, come on, guys. Can you blame me for wanting to be nostalgic for this opening skit? It's fine to be nostalgic, but try to put some effort into it at least. Okay, that's it. Stop production. Alfred, what the hell, dude? I thought you would be a good replacement production manager, but now you're writing cliche opening skits that have flashbacks? What the hell, man? I'm sorry, Mr. Studios. I just thought that it would be nostalgic for the fans. Yeah, sure, I understand that and all, but that doesn't mean recycling an opening skit from a video from two and a half years ago. I am deeply sorry, sir. Yeah, you should be sorry. All right, I'm going on my fucking lunch break. One Taco Bell order later. I definitely won't regret that decision. All right, you ready to give this another shot to see if we actually got this right this time? I believe you will quite like the new script, Sir Bonnie, sir. You better be right about that. Let me see this shit. Bonnie gets scammed and decides to break the item for plot convenience rather than returning said item? Already did that. Really? Okay, hold on. Try this one on for size. Bonnie's mother gets mad at him for talking to devices and then she ruins them, resulting in Bonnie breaking said item for plot convenience. Okay, is this a joke at this point? Okay, okay, let me give this another shot. Sir Bonnie, sir, I'm sorry, but that's every idea in the book. You've done it all at this point. No, it can't be. I'm actually out of known ideas for these videos? Wait a minute, what's that? Well, it looks like I have no other choices at this point. <gasps> this is genius! How have I never thought of something like this before? Alright, without any other further ado, time to get to work, ladies and gentlemen. Well, all that truly happened from that is that, yeah, the bottom fell off. That's great. Yo, yeet! Oh, shit. Nice. Hey, you! What? Wanna play Catch the Hatchet? Yeah, that has absolutely no way of going wrong whatsoever. Alright, here you go. Oh, hell yeah, I caught it. Oh, shit. Aw, oh, damn it! I knew putting my MacBook there for plot convenience would be a bad idea. Better salt the roads for ice, because as you can see, the roads just have that much ice on them. <laughs> Somewhere over the rainbow... Oh shit, somebody left their MacBook there. I hope that I don't get fired for this crap. Rockwell, what the hell are you doing salting roads that have no ice on them and pouring the salt all over someone's MacBook on top of that? You're fired. Damn it, this is all your fault, even though it was my fault for being a stupid dipshit in the first place. Stupid fucking MacBook! You know, since we already have the hatchet out and everything, 
Might as well. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I know that part of me is going to end up regretting this, but snow. Oh, that was beautiful. Bitch, you ain't got no class. No, you ain't got no class. You want to say that again, you dodecadum ass? Now what the hell is that? A 12-sided dumbass. Fight me, bitch. No, you. Maybe I will. Snarl. Hiss. And the MacBook that's not been put through eight ways of torture already is perfectly unscathed. Wish I could say the same for this guy. Ladies, ladies, please. You both got no class. What, what did, did you, you say, say bitch? bitch? Ah, shit! Hey bro, good hustle at the cliche event football game. Thanks man, you did pretty good yourself. Whoa, who's that? Oh, her? That's just some nerdy girl that is definitely not a setup for some expected plot twist. Whoa, she's stunning. When did you know that you were going to ask me to the generic theme dance? From the moment our eyes met. What the hell kind of movie was that? First of all, the film is so bad that it even acknowledges that it's a cliche. Second, the jocks are arrogant dipshits that only care about themselves. And third, people don't look so drastically different without their glasses on that you would fall in love with them. And it's really petty as hell to like someone just for their looks anyways. I hate rom-com bullshit. Your time has come. Ah, uh, hell yeah. I can't wait to watch explicit content on this floppy disk right here. What the hell? This thing doesn't have a floppy disk drive? How dare this thing not have a slot for technology that became obsolete 30 years ago? Stupid shit never works the way I would like it to work. Good lord, I regret everything now. Oh, looks like I'm getting a call. Hello? Congratulations, you have won a free trip to North Dakota. Why the hell would I choose to go to North Dakota over South Dakota? Press 1 to answer a few questions to claim your trip. Hey, you know what? I'll have some fun with this. Hello, sir. You are on your way to winning your free trip to North Dakota. What the hell happened to already winning it? Look, you want to be a little smartass or do you want to answer the question? Okay, fine. First question, what is your address? All right, my address is 124 North Dakota Avenue of North Dakota, USA. Wait, so you're already in North Dakota? Yes, sir. You know what, screw it, I don't care. Let's move on. What's your mother's maiden name? Okay, my mother's maiden name is shut the fuck up and stop asking about my mom, you butt licker. Thank you. Now is that all one word or with a hyphen? Wait a minute! Okay, you little fuck nugget. I know you think you're so funny, but you're not, okay? Now you can go ahead and answer these damn questions, or there will be a special spot in hell for you if there isn't already. Okay, sorry ma'am. Don't call me ma'am! I'm a man! Oh, my mistake. It was hard to tell with your shrill voice. 
<sighs> Final question. Okay, what's your credit card number? No, what's your credit card number? Come on, man, don't make this any harder than it has to be. No, you know what? If you want to know my personal information so bad, then I have a right to know yours. So, if you could please tell me your zip code, your credit card number, your PIN number, your first pet's name, the last four digits of your social security number, your great great aunt's cousin's bestie's middle name, everything in your house including the house itself, and your right to breathe oxygen as well, then that would be great. I can't believe I put myself through this shit! What? Two dollars? I can't even wax my mustache for that price! Oh shit. Yep, on way 15 and this is happening. I just can't wait to see what the next 35 ways hold for this. You know what? If those floppy disks don't even work on my computer, then I don't even have a purpose to have them anyways. Hmm, now where should I break these things? Oh, right on top of my prized possession doesn't seem like a bad spot. Let's start with you, hentai. Wow, these things are actually pretty tough. Not for long! Ah, that was pretty satisfying, but wait, is that my MacBook? No, the Apple's all gone. Let's not get started on this beautiful mess. Damn it, dude, breaking those hard drives on top of my prized possession like I literally acknowledged was such a bad idea. <sighs> shit, 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 I just noticed something. Yeah, you see that? That wasn't there the last way, so you know what that means. Yeah, okay. It's no secret that the trackpad is basically just a safety hazard at this point. So I feel like the best thing for this is to just... Okay, okay. It is your time to perish, my friend. I might regret this, but... Come on, load my movie, damn it! Oh, come on! I gotta watch 35 minutes of this film I've never heard of before I decide that I don't like it! Netflix. Get pissed when your movie involving actors you will never hear from again doesn't load. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Virgin Tech Review. Today, we have reviewed that this Apple 2014 MacBook can be used as a remote. So let's see if that's true. All right, so I'm pointing the thing at my TV and power on. 
Are you serious? I can't watch my irrelevant movies on this thing either? You know, I'm a pacifist. I don't believe in violence. Luckily, that only applies for violence with humans. Piece of shit. That was a bad snap. Oh god. Oh god. Looks like this thing should visit the chiropractor. Hello, I am Dr. Crack Yo Mama's back. How may I be assistance for you today? Yeah, hi. My MacBook keeps doing this for some reason, and I was wondering if you could pop its back, if that's even possible to fix it. Well, I never worked on a device before, but sure, I'm up for the challenge. Okay, sir. So what I am going to do is pop your back like so. Are you ready? All right, I want you to exhale. Hmm, I have heard no cracks. It is on to the next method, bending until his back cracks. Oh, yes. All righty, sir. I think you are cured now. Okie dokie, sir. I think I have fixed your friend's problem. Gee, thanks, Doc. Wait a minute. What the hell did you do? He ain't supposed to bend that way. Oh, well, sir, for my excruciating labor with fixing your friend comes a large fee of $700. $700? You must think I'm crazier than Clark Griswold to spend prices like that on this guy. Just take this friend as payment. Ah, shit. Now it is $800. Damn it! Why didn't you jump, Mario? Wait. This way seems kind of familiar. Damn it! Why didn't you jump, Mario? 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 Ah, oh, God! No matter how hard I try, every single Ways to Break video is going to be basically the same thing, but with a different item. There's only one way to fix that issue. The hammer of new ideas shall rain down. Oh, you poor soul. Here, have some water. Huh, that's odd. It just seemed to absorb all the water and leave it gone without a trace. Maybe that's why your longevity rate is not applicable. Hmm, you know, I could just take that MacBook and... Here, how about another back adjustment? Dude, no. Don't let those intrusive thoughts win again. It's so bad that you owe so many people money from life insurance for how many times you've died. I don't even know how that works. Uh... That's not sitting there all destroyed because I actually did that, right? You know what? Screw it. I'm not feeling sympathy for you now. Give it to me like... Whoa. Say hello to my little friend. My dick. Uh-oh. <laughs> My name is My Balls.
Since my Netflix still won't load since Way 19, I can't catch up on my favorite shows and have to avoid spoilers. <gasps> Who's there? It is I. <gasps> spoilers! Yep, that is correct. And did you know that in season two of Wednesday, Wednesday and Enid become canon? Ah, no! I can't hear this shit! I won't hear this shit! And did you know that in season 7 of Gumball that is coming out soon, they're going to take the crashing of the fabric of reality even further? No! Don't tell me that of all things! And did you know that the Simpsons will continue to predict the future? <sighs> eh. You know what? I don't have to listen to your crap. Oh! All right, looks like I finally found a private room to- <gasps> Oh, sorry, I didn't know anyone else was in here. It's all right, man. Hey, can you settle a dispute for us? What race is Santa? Guys, Santa is white. Santa can't be white. Santa is Indian. Cram it, Gandhi. Everyone knows that Santa is Chinese. How can Santa be Chinese? He doesn't drive his sleigh 20 miles under the speed limit, and he doesn't talk about how disappointed he is that his son didn't become a doctor at age three. Santa's obviously black. Santa can't be black. We don't fear him. Come on, man. Seriously? You really had to do me like that? Seriously? You think he's the one that made the most racist comment? Oh, go back to your rice patty, Mulan! Everybody shut up! Sam, talk! Oh! Is! Ow! White! Ah! Hook smash! Ugh. Oh, it's a butterfly. Oh, the wire. Oh gosh. You know what? Do you think one more hit will do it? Yeah, I say so. Go for it. Oh. Hell yes, my man. There you go. Nice. Oh yeah. Got it. Great job. Strip the wire. Yes, hell yeah. Ready? Yeah. Oh god. Time for this piece. Oh yes. Oh jeez. Go for it. So there's that layer. That layer. That layer. That layer. You want to come try this? Yeah, hold on. Okay. You want to go, son? <laughs> yes, son. I do want to go. What do you got for us? Oh, God. <laughs> you want a tortilla? Yes, please. I would love a tortilla right about now. I'm just splitting it. Yeah, I know. When you and your brother want tapsies. <laughs> yep, ain't that right. Sloppy seconds. Here you go. Thank you, sir. I will eat this taco with glee. Oh, oh! Look at the back of this. <laughs> try and rip it off. Go for it! Absolutely. Oh, easier than expected, huh? A lot of things are easier than expected when you put your mind to it. Giggity. If, if the viewers know what I mean. Yeah, they should.
oh. half season with your brother, be like, here you go. Thanks, bro. Half season with your sister, be like, here you go. Thanks. Here, I'll give back another halfsies. I don't want it. <laughs> I lost control. Oh no. Anything but the control key. What? I lost control. <laughs> Sicko mode. Oh. I knew this would come handy. There's no escape. Oh my god. Bro is hilarious. Please help. I can't power down. But um bum <laughs> Great. Your turn. I lost control. There's no escape. I can't power down. All of the above. Oh god. Rip it like a man. Oh, you got it, brother. Now we'll tear this shit like paper. It's, uh, you gonna see me tear a chunk of metal? Yes. Whoa. Bro's flexing his strength. Just. Yeah. Let's it fall. When your teacher assigned you homework, your computer be like, <laughs> it won't work, teacher. Okay, <laughs> do you understand me? I don't like you. Uh oh. <sighs> now I gotta go to the principal's office. <laughs> I think you know where this is going. Oh god, that didn't even make a dent. That broke the MacBook more than the ice. Damn it! Jesse's not here to finish this with me!
Thank you guys so much for watching 50 Ways to Break a MacBook 2. All in all, this video took about, including scripts and everything, from January 9th to today. So that is around two and a half weeks. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this. But thank you guys again one last time for watching, and I'll see you with the final video soon. Goodbye, guys.